your thoughts have become a weapon against you. And that is not living your best life. That is not living in what God intended for you because God intended good for you. My thoughts towards you are that of good and not of evil. And I'm gonna get you to that expected end, but I can't get you to that expected end when your focus is all over the place and you got all this anxiety going on inside of you. Have you ever tried to help somebody that was anxious? That's a mess. It's a mess. I mean, they won't stop crying. They won't stop. Hey, but, 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 what you, my mama used, she just slapped me. Get it together. Get it together, girl. We got to get it together. We got to get it together. Because the ship is going to sink. Because we ain't got it together. Do you realize that if, if, if you don't know how to swim, if you can calm yourself, you will float. You will float. Mm -hmm. But the problem is because you don't know, you're worried about what might happen and you sink. People drown because they don't know they can float. Jesus. 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 Father, right now in the name of Jesus, I just want to thank you for this word because I know I've needed it. I know I've needed it. And I, I just say, it's me, oh Lord, standing in the need of prayer. It's me, oh Lord, needing this word. I need to learn how to walk this word and how to utilize this word. You gave it. And God, you would never put something in front of us that we cannot walk. Teach us how to access our weapons. We have been taught well that we have the weapons. We have been taught well what we have, but we haven't been taught how to access it. God, it, it's kind of like having a million dollars in the bank and dying of starvation. Having everything that we need, and all we got to do is just access it but don't know how. Teach us how to pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen.